Okay, I'm going to attempt to fix the power cord issue on this Acer. You can see it just came back from the repair depot. Here's the sticker. I tried peeling it off, but I uh, need some more work to get the whole sticker off. And they did a good job for what they did fix, but they left out fixing the power cord issue. So I pushed the power cord in, and it just does not charge. So I need to try to fix this so I can uh, end up with a laptop again. And this one here is a, it's an Acer. Let's see what's on the back here. Not a whole lot. It's an Acer. I don't know what to tell you. Okay. So, I'm going to start uh, by disassembling all the screws on the back side of it. And see where it goes from there. So I'll be back with you as this laptop starts coming apart. Alright, while I'm back with this thing, uh, the Acer apart, I got the whole top off, which that's pretty much the keyboard and your mouse pad. And I took off the monitor completely. And I located the issue. One of the wires actually came unsoldered off the back of the little uh, a little power adapter here it came unsoldered that's why it stopped charging so it goes to tell me whenever I would move that little plug-in the adapter part then I was moving this whole box and it would basically be moving it to the point where it would touch the contact and it would charge and then I'd release it and it would just to say missed uh, the wire and break the contact and would not charge anymore so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to solder this back on, that little wire, and uh, reassemble everything. Pretty big job, folks. Pretty complicated unit here. Pretty delicate. Very delicate. First time approaching anything like this. Hopefully I'll be successful. And I'll be back with you um, as it's coming along. Okay, I've got this little wee wire soldered back on, on here. Now I need to put it back in this little spot, which is down in here, and reassemble everything. The uh, only tricky part is, is the black wire. What's the video card? And that's got to be fed through here, so I might have to take off the motherboard to get it through the right channels and down to the underside of it. I'm not sure yet. And other than that, the pop cover pretty much just pops in place, and then it has quite a few screws on the underside of it. And then I have to re-put the little speakers back on. I mean, look at these little speakers. Laptop speaker. Pretty tiny. This one goes over here, and there's another one that goes over right over here. But they were in the way for the uh, releasing of the wires. And then I'll put the monitor back on. And um, I plugged it in, the battery's charging good, light's coming on solid. I wiggled it around a little bit, nice and... There is no light coming off, so it's a constant charge. Which, that's what we're after here. And I'll end up with my laptop back. Okay, I'll be back with you. Alright, well the screen's back on, speakers are back in, here's a speaker there, and there's another speaker here, and the little power adapter is there, you can see it right here, and this wire here is back in place, and I got this white wire, it goes tucks underneath the motherboard, and here it is here, it goes on the underside of it, so now I'm going to put the keyboard back on top, and I'm going to insert the uh, the disk drive. Here's the disk drive here. It goes like such there. That's back in place. So now the top board here, I'm going to fix it back in place and uh, get all the screws back underneath it and get the hard drive and a few of the other bits and pieces back on it and um, plug it in and see what happens. And I'll be back with you and let you know how it went. Okay, I had to take the keyboard off. And the reason being is to um, 
get these little ribbon wires on in their place wouldn't be able to do it with it a part like this so we'll put that aside and this ribbon here I'm having a very difficult time getting it onto the motherboard and then there's this one here which will be easy enough but this one here doesn't leave a whole lot there you see there's barely anything very difficult actually maybe it ain't difficult now that I see a hole here oh I see okay I'll be back with you let me work with this okay it's all back together now let's uh, let me plug the power cord in here and see if a little light comes on right here let's see there it is look at that charging just like it's supposed to be okay now let's start it up and make sure it's gonna come on it's looking good so far like I say this was my first attempt and I pretty much had to take the whole thing apart looks like I uh, did an okay job I don't have any screws left over everything went back in place relatively easy well, it's looking okay well that's good news the repair depot forgot to fix that uh, power cord issue but instead of shipping it back and having it gone for another month well I just did it myself so my mouse still moves that's good now I'm going to power it down shutting down that's great back working okay well thank you for watching my first attempt taking apart a laptop computer and fixing a power cord issue and success is good.